I have a huge shopping haul for you guys. Some items I've purchased over the past few months and some were very, very recent. So hopefully you guys can get some of these items I'm going to share with you. So first, let's start with home decor. I always try to buy off season and I faithfully shop the clearance aisle and I want to encourage and inspire you to do the same to save money. The first item was a very recent buy. I shared this picture on my Instagram at Be My Guest with Denise on this Valentine's Day table setting for two. One Saturday, I just started playing around with some dishes and fabrics and I came up with this playfully using different textures and using the non-traditional color pink instead of red to change things up a bit and of course I had to pop in a pineapple tumbler on the table I got it from TJ Maxx for $12.99 and they had it in silver as well Over the holidays, I hauled this candlestick for $8. Regular price, $19.99, and the magic rustic vase next to it was there, but I patiently waited for it to go down to $8 as well. I got both of them for the price of one. And at Home Goods, you guys know my love for tier trays, and I fell in love with this one. It looks like a spaceship, I know, but that's what I love about it, its uniqueness. It goes perfectly with my Nambe salad bowl that I got from the flea market for $5. I can see some entertaining with these over the summer. Most of you have seen my master bedroom makeover tour and in case you missed it, I will have a link down below. Here I had it decorated for Christmas and now that the holidays are over, I am springing forward for some spring home decor. The color coral has always been a favorite of mine and when I came across these pillows, I knew this was the color I'm going to be using in our bedroom. The lumbar pillow was a JCPenney's find and the rest of the coral pillows are from raw stores. They were $9.99 each. The coral throw, I forgot where I got it. I've had it for years, but they sell them at any home store. Another Ross find was this Sea Rock Candle Votive. It was $3.99. I love the natural look and feel of it. It is just something different. Z Gallery is the home decor headquarters. This is a store you will not find me at often, but what I do know is that they do have a clearance section, and I'm not sure if it's every Z Gallery, but at this one, it was. This was a very, very recent buy. Last Saturday recent, I came across these flute and champagne glasses. Now get this, they were $12.95 each, regular price. Denise's price was $3.79 each. They were having a 70% off clearance with an additional 10% off. That's a total of 80% off. You guys, I almost lost it. I share deals as I come across them on my Instagram and Facebook, so be sure to follow me at Be My Guest with Denise so you can get some of these deals too. Home Goods Clearance is the first aisle I'll go to before I go down any other aisle. I got eight of these bowls after Christmas and they have these beautiful gold detail on them that I just love. They have matching plates as well, but you can definitely mix them with regular white dishes and they were a total steal, a dollar each. Regular price, $3.99. Dutch ovens is the one thing I use the most when I'm cooking. I shared this deal on this Dutch oven on my Instagram. Sam's Club was selling them for $29.99, regular price $39.99, and they come in other colors, and I'll have a link down below in case you guys want one. This is my second one, and I love them. One downfall though, they are super heavy, so I always keep the larger one on top of my stove, and I really don't mind it because it matches my kitchen decor. It really pays to shop off season to get deals like this. Home Goods had this pumpkin for half price. It's super huge. And they also had a smaller one for $4. The glass pumpkin is such a beauty. Shopping off season makes it possible to decorate when that season comes. And this pumpkin was only $12. Ikea is another affordable place to get your one-stop shopping done. Ikea also has a clearance section up to 50% off and they had these ghost chairs which can be pricey and they were $47.50 which was a steal because as you can see the regular price is $79 each. So if you're shopping at Ikea, check here first. Home organization. Who knew organizing your kitchen drawers can be life-changing after taking action on a few of these steps? 
Once again, my trip to Ikea in the kitchen section, they have these utensil organizers for $1.19 each for the white ones and 99 cents for the gray ones. Very affordable. Now the thing about these units are that they are made for Ikea kitchens, so they may not fit your drawers, so be sure to measure before you buy them. I promise you, you guys, last year I cleaned this drawer out and I still have items I really don't use or really need. So I did another purge. That's my tip. Get rid of items you do not need. What I love about these organizers are that they are compartmentalized. So you can only put but so much in them. It really makes you think twice about something you really don't need. And for $1.19, you really can't beat how pretty it looks. This bamboo utensil knife tray is my absolute favorite upgrade to my drawers. This is also part of the IKEA kitchen, so once again, please be sure to measure before you buy it. If you don't need this big one or if you have smaller drawers, the smaller one just may work for you. I also purchased new knives, three in a pack for only $5.99 each. They are really sharp and they look great in the drawer. What a difference it makes after the purge. There's not much in it, but that's the purpose of only using what I need and there's still room to grow. In my bathroom, I have a small drawer for my makeup brushes, tools, and makeup applicators like wedges, cotton balls, etc. I really do not like having the leftovers in a Ziploc bag because I tend to overbuy because it's tucked away in this bin in my linen closet and I just forget that it's even there. But I found a solution, this five piece set of acrylic containers with lids for $14.99 and having lids is definitely a plus but stacking is an even bigger bonus and it's from Ikea. The larger box I'm using for cotton balls, I always keep lots of cotton balls on hand. It holds a half a bag of cotton balls. My applicators fit perfectly in one of the smaller containers along with my wedge applicators and the longer container is perfect for my cosmetic squares. Now I don't have to overbuy, I can see what I need and when I'm getting low. Discount stores. If you have one in your area, you will be amazed at what you will find. This eight piece set of OXO Softworks I got for $39 brand new and I bought both of them that you see here. If you are familiar with them, you know they can run you about $100 for the set. But if you are on a budget, IKEA has you covered with their food storage containers. They start at $3.99. They are such a great space saver and they keep your food fresh. Also in the clearance area, I found these teal storage bins for $2 each. They had white and black ones as well. Regular price, $5.99. I bought eight of them for a little over $17. I also picked up a pack of these lithium batteries for $1.99 for a pack of eight. I haven't used them yet, so I pray they last long, but for $1.99, I don't know, but we will see. Never hunt through your clutter for batteries ever again. I keep all of our batteries in this organizer I got from the Dollar Tree. This is definitely a time saver when you need to find a battery. And the last item is this catch-all box from Target. It's on clearance right now for $10.48. Just use your red card to get an extra 10% off and check the cartwheel to see if there's any additional savings. You may have seen me use them on my desk to keep little odds and ends in them. And I've even used them to keep my gold utensils in them too. You will have to wait to see what I'll be doing next. So I hope I have inspired you to get organized and decorate around your home for the spring. Come on, you guys, you got this. If I can do it, you can do it too. And I want to thank you all for watching.